Hello, hello, boys and girls. This is Adagil, of course, and welcome back to another the Swede vlog. It's a long time since I did a Swede vlog the last time, and I think it's it's kind of time a little bit of like channel update and that kind of stuff. Uh, so. Uh, pfft. I don't know, there's not much to tell, uh, like, my private life hasn't really changed a lot since the last time I did one, so there's not really anything interesting to tell you about. As you can see, there, there's actually light in the background. <laughs> the sun is actually out, it's it's kind of slowly becoming summer, it's, it's kind of um, uh, spring here at the moment. A little bit of grass and a few flowers are popping up, so I'm, I'm generally more happy thanks to that, but... Today was kind of shitty. It, it looks like it's really bright outside, but it's it's not. It's it's kind of rainy and gloomy, but still better than fucking snow and cold, I must say. Uh, when it comes to the videos on my channel, I'm uh, mostly doing CSGO, and uh, gonna try to do a little bit of CSGO tutorials, doing Half-Life 2 still. Uh, should be uh, maybe a new episode out uh, a couple of days ago or something like that. Uh, also doing a little bit of GTA 5 with Doc, hopefully that's gonna be doing well. And also 7 Days to Die, of course, and then not a lot, actually. Personally, I'm playing a little bit of Fallout New Vegas with all of the DLC, like, privately, not making videos of it or anything like that. Sorry, guys, I know a lot of people would like to see that, but I'm just kind of enjoying it again privately. And I'm... Um, I'm also looking forward to Witcher 3. I'm not sure if I'm gonna make any kind of videos out of Witcher 3. Uh, maybe some videos, but I don't think I'm gonna do a Let's Play. I'm, I'm not sure yet, though. But it's time will tell, simply. But yeah, that's that's pretty much it. I don't have much to say, but we got ourselves a big ass fucking package. The Frenchies, Le Baguettes, <laughs> Viva Le Baguettes, Viva Le Baguettes, or something. I don't know. <laughs> Fuck it. Let, let's. I've already kind of pre-opened it a little bit, so it won't be too damn difficult. There's a lot of packing stuff in here, that's for that's for damn sure. You know what? I think I'm actually going to open the top too. Yeah, yeah, I think I see a letter here. Fucking shit. Is, is there a fucking gorilla costume in there or something? It's a letter marked Anderzeal. I have no clue what the fuck's in here. This, this feels like some kind of a prank thing, to be honest. <laughs> I got bad feelings about this one. And as usual, if you want to send me a letter or a package or something stupid, uh, you can just check out the video description to see the address. Uh, please don't read the following, okay. Won't read that. Let's see. Oh, here we go. Hello, Anderps. It's me again, your friend's boost provider. <laughs> My name is R R Aurelian, aka Blunt Twenty One in game. Yeah, thank you very much. Uh, I, I did very much enjoy the wine. I, I think you were the one that sent me the wine. I sent you a big package last time, and the letter came after for some reason. But I'm glad you got it all. Uh, I really enjoy watching you open it, and I regret nothing. <laughs> well, maybe the cheese, but I won't make the same mistake. Yeah, yeah, it was you. It was you. Yeah, the man, the, the cheese kind of smelled up the, the joint and it kind of went bad if you know what I mean but other than that the wine and everything was fucking awesome and the crackers and stuff um, I thought I sent you something for Christmas and it's April 16th but it's the thought that counts right open the package now if you will good luck with that by the way uh, this time around I sent you some traditional alcohol from the northwest of France plus one bottle of spa sparkling white wine nice Except the wine these drinks are for la la uh, when we have drinks before dinner. Oh, okay, so kind of like a Swedish snaps, I guess, before the sill or before the pickled herring or yeah, never mind. <laughs> Probably makes no sense at all. Uh, and of course, some random things. Oh, by the way, guys, I, I got a haircut and I haven't put anything in my hair. And I, I see now that I have like a top. <laughs> Fucking look ridiculous. Oh, never mind. <laughs> never mind. Uh, let's see. Uh, the one called Hydromel uh, or Koshen is made from honey and it's from Brit Brittany. Uh, the one called Traus 
Pinetti is made from the spinky branches of some plum trees and it is from uh, Ven uh, Vende. I don't know what that is, man. The Charette de Dye is <laughs> the sparkling white wine. And I was always. I was always told a good sparkling wine is better than a bad champagne. Yeah, that's true. Um, this bottle is a leftover from my birthday, and I was, and it was really good. At least that's what I remember. <laughs> but I may or may not have already been drunk when we opened them. Okay, <laughs> usually we we drink that for some social celebration or oh, special celebration birthday new year's or newborn or the appet up appetitive <laughs> it's a classic uh, liquor oh my god i'll be in belgium this summer so maybe you get some belgian beers <laughs> nice uh not that i can find them here but they'll be much cheaper oh okay okay and uh, they're very expensive in france i guess to import then there's two things I wanted to talk about. A friend of mine and I really like to learn Swedish just for the fun of it. Uh, and so for his birthday, I had an idea of getting him a book in Swedish. Best place to find books in Swedish? Uh, question mark Ikea. They put them in every fake living room they have. So I went to Ikea and stole a book from the fake living room. <laughs> Turns out it's some erotic pornographic. No, well, I guess my question is, how do you... <laughs> how do... How, how do they do in Sweden? Dude, I have no clue. Do they use erotic novel books in other foreign language? Or do they use actual books? And last thing, uh, I know you try to record these go videos basically every match you play, but how how do you do it? Uh, do you try each match, and if it doesn't go like you want to stop? Yeah, actually, that that's how I do it. Uh, I, I try almost every single match I play, except if it is just for fun, and if it goes to shit, uh, it, I'll just stop recording. And uh, I keep talking with the team like I, I do, like, but I obviously don't talk to myself and stuff. Uh, but instead, I, I try to shut the fuck up a bunch uh, and do good and try to get like montage footage instead, so to say. So I kind of try to double task it. <laughs> uh, like, do you stop recording during the match or do you keep the camera rolling? Do you stop as soon as you have an episode done or do you keep playing after? I usually play one match afterwards because sometimes you might do good like two matches in a row because you're on a roll. Um, if it took you three matches to have a decent episode, did you talk about the same stuff in three matches or do you, uh, did it change every time you tried to record? Uh, it usually changes actually. Uh, it usually changes. Uh, unless if it's some kind of a co-op and me and the person doing the co-op has like decided on a subject to talk about, I usually never like do the same thing again because otherwise you kind of lose that spontaneous feel to it. And, and it just doesn't fit as well. A lot of the same jokes, though, I tell, like, my teammates and stuff I reuse, of course. But that, you probably already know who has been watching my videos for a long time. I like to repeat the same jokes, like, screw you guys, I'm going home, or god diggity damn, or crippity crap, and, and that kind of stupid crap. Um, that's it for me, keep up the good work, and I hope to play in some match again. Uh, have a nice day, no potato this time but sorry for the long letter Aurelian. I hope I don't pronounce your name incorrectly I'm so sorry if I do but thank you very much uh, my god it took me a long time to read holy shit okay let's, let's see what the heck's inside here whoa <laughs> I've already found something good I think <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see but it's it's not way there and he says I will not be your father. And it's like obviously a condom if you guys don't know what it is. is. But yeah, that's, 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 that's a fucking good one too. Holy shit. This is this is why I like the French. They always send such nice things. What the fuck? Jävla tomteluva. It, it's the goddamn Santa Claus hat. What the fuck? Oh, oh, I was like, why is there this thing here? But I guess... 
either you turn it or do something to make it okay maybe the battery is out it, it, <laughs> it doesn't shine hopefully this isn't full of like some some horrible stuff please Francis don't hate me and say <laughs> what the fuck is this <laughs> also some goddamn fucking I don't know what the hell this is this looks almost like the, the like the Swedish and Russian hats what the fuck man <laughs> This is really weird stuff. Herp. <laughs> herp, derp, derp, derp. <laughs> what the fuck? Why do people send me stupid hats all the time? God damn it! I don't. I don't even wear hats for God's sakes. It, it's bad enough. I'm. I'm losing some of my hair because of the fucking headset I always wear. God dang it! It's right up here, man. Like, right there. I don't know. It looks like it's indentated, but I think I'm losing a bit of hair. I don't know. It might just be me being, being like, pessimistic or, or freaking out. Uh. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. This is the good stuff. This is the good stuff. Screw those fucking hats, man. This is the good stuff, I think. Hopefully this isn't, like, the sparkling wine and I open the cork by mistake and fucking shoot myself in the eye or some stupid crap. Oh, my God much newspaper uh, at least it hasn't broken it in customs though so that that's good stuff you oh my god <sighs> i'll be back in a minute as soon as i open this okay <laughs> holy fuck this is hard to open god damn <sighs> Man, it took me like 15 minutes to open them all. Uh, but okay, here, here's, uh, I guess this is the, the sparkling white wine. It says, Clarit de Dia. Never mind. <laughs> and then we have, uh, Trues Benete Epines Nuires. Holy fucking shit. I read it so fucking poorly, man. God damn it. Big, big bottles. Don't, don't get confused now. I got big hands, so th this big bottles. I think it's like, yeah, 75 centiliter bottles. Holy fucking shit, man. And then this, I don't really know what it is. 13%. I, I guess this is wine as well. Me Melmor. Le Mille de la Mer. Hushen. Rommel. <laughs> I have no clue if I'm reading that the correct way, but yeah, holy shit. Got myself some booze. So let's see, that was 30%. This is. What? Sem no, can't be. 75%? Yeah, no, no, no. 7.5. Oh. I didn't see the little dot there in that. I was like, what the fuck? Sparkling white wine that's 75%? Damn! Did buy 96% alcohol though in Poland. They have these little small bottles that like, if you drink the whole thing, you get like as drunk as drinking like a 70 centiliter one. And this man, I... I'm not quite sure. Man, she did describe what everything was, but I have horrible... Memory, 14.4%, so basically like, like wine stuff, all of it. Fucking good stuff. I wonder this. It looks like red wine. Make sure to try to send her a message and ask how expensive it is. <laughs> because I don't want to make like a good the red wine sauce if it's like really expensive wine. You should do that, that, that would be kind of an insult. But if, if, if it's like normally pints wine then I think doing wine, uh, red wine sauce out of it is good as well I, I did do red wine sauce out of her the red wine she sent me the last time and that was the first one I ever did with real red wine and like oh damn it was good but yeah <laughs> that's, that's gonna be it for this video Fuck, I love the French fucking hell man boost 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 I like it. Anyways, as usual, thank you guys so very much for watching. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.